Hey guys, it's Mike Sorg at Sorgatron on the Twitter for basic Sorgonomics for this May 21st, 2015. We're ready to uh, get into talking about podcasting. There's a lot going on with Spotify, uh, doing fitness video podcasts and more. And I definitely have some opinions on at least one side of it. Uh, but again, please go over to Sorgatron.com, sign up for our newsletter, uh, check out our Friday blog and everything else, all the other shows. We're uh, doing doing a lot of stuff. Also posted the uh, uh, basics of uh, Instagram, uh, Pinterest. I keep wanting to call it Pinstagram because I made the joke during the uh, during the uh, uh, session, and now that's stuck in my head. And Snapchat, uh, a good two hour session where we talked about all three of those slideshows are up there. A lot of tips, kind of get your head around it a little bit, uh, get some help that I didn't have going into, especially Snapchat and trying to figure it out, and uh, so much more. Thank you for uh, joining us. Uh, you know, if you follow me at Sorgatron on Twitter, you can also uh, most mornings. Most mornings during the week, you can join me on Periscope and Meerkat. Not Meerkat this morning, because I need to charge the iPad. Uh, but uh, Periscope with us today. We got three people in there uh, looking for comments and uh, hopefully uh, you know something that will contribute to the show as we're going here. So let's take, get into Spotify. Big announcement, of course, uh, over the last 24 hours. I actually found it first from um, um, our friends over at Lipson. Uh, ironically, we're going to be talking with Crystal O'Connor from Lipson here on uh, evening, w- evening with PodCamp on next uh, Wednesday at the hardware store. And uh, so they're part of this big announcement. And Lipson is one of the biggest hosts out there, I think, uh, as far as podcasting goes. Uh, so what is Spotify doing? You know, we've, we've heard about, you know, Taylor Swift's, Swift's had the war on them. Uh, everybody's Everybody in the music industry is mad because they're not making enough money per listens off of Spotify as a streaming service. So Spotify needs to do something, right? And, and, and we've seen Pandora have these issues, you know, same issues where they're like, well, we're out, we're making money, we're doing good, but we're giving it most of all, most of it to the record industry and we can't keep afloat. And it's just not, not working out for anybody. And they're diversifying. Like I said, they have partners, they're doing videos. It looks like they have a few partners like uh, from the samples I saw on video, uh, like Vice, like, uh, uh, you know, a few other providers, looks like Comedy Central, you know, we, we see the ladies from Broad City on stage here uh, for this. So you're going to get video content, whether it be clips, full shows, whatever the case may be. And uh, good, it's a little more, you know, a little more to it. Also, fitness, I think is really interesting, too. So apparently, if you're using Spotify and you're in, I guess, a fitness mode, you're actually going to be able to have songs be selected Based on what you already listen to in Spotify, but as your pace and uh, your pace and your I don't know heart rate I don't know if they'll go they go that deep, uh, but it'll adjust to you as as you're running as you're doing whatever you're doing as you're you know depending on what's going on uh, that's pretty good and there's some commentary I was listening to Daily Tech News show as I as I usually do and uh, they said that it's really impressive that you know what it knows when you sign up for the service right off the bat. And then podcasts, and then that's this is where where I have probably most of my opinions on is the podcasting side of things. So there it looks like they're launching your your usual suspects are going to be Twits there this week in tech, uh, Nerdist, the WTF podcast. But how am I going to do this? And from what I'm seeing so far, it looks like they're going to be very curated. You're not going to have Joe's podcast on this thing. You're going to have Joe's podcast if he subscribes to Lipson though. So that's an option. That's one thing that could be happening. Uh, so from the Lipson announcement, and they had a uh, the Lipson's The Feed, uh, which is their kind of podcast about podcast about podcasting. Uh, very circular. Uh, but Elsie uh, and, and uh, I forget the co-host on there. Elsie, um, of course, has been here with uh, PodCamp Pittsburgh. Had some great sessions over on PodCamp Pittsburgh's um, YouTube uh, account with her. I definitely recommend if you're new to podcasting or anything like that. But it looks like you're going to have to be a part of one of their partners. Um, in one case, you know, Libsyn, not bad. Five bucks a month for posting my podcast on there and we're in Spotify. That's cool. That's cool. Now, me, have you looked up Sorgatron Media on iTunes lately? Uh, could you imagine me dropping five bucks on every single one of those feeds? That the, at least the, the the current ones, the ones that are still uh, producing new content, uh, you know, not exactly in the budget just yet. You know, hopefully get some sponsored Patreons, we can take care of that. I'd love to move lips in. So in the meantime, you know, some of us that are on other services that aren't 
connected yet with Spotify. And maybe this is something that as it goes, it'll they'll open it up. Maybe they're just launching very close to begin with. And they'll open it up as they go. So they don't have this giant deluge of, can, you get my, can I get my show on Spotify? Because I'm, I want on it. It's a it's a it's a platform. Everybody, just about everybody I know that listens to streaming music or radio or of, of any sort is on Spotify, for the most part. It is certainly kind of becoming the household name uh, as far as that goes. So, but also I think this kind of perturbs a little bit because a lot of people roll their own podcasts, and now what? do you do you're not going through a service you're you you have a, a uh i think it's a pod press is what you can install and it'll do all the rssing and everything and all of those podcasts get pulled off of your server like maybe you got a GoDaddy or something like that you're not going to be a partner you're doing your own thing so unless you're big enough to be like twit that they get courted you know or they say hey we want to be part of this and they're like oh yeah we know you come on aboard um I don't. I think you're going to be out of luck, and I think that kills. I don't know, and again, it could be a very curated thing, sure. But I think that I don't know. Podcasting, you think opening is it's it's supposed to be an open medium, man. Anybody can do it, man. That's why podcasting rules, man. I mean, it really is the uh, uh, the hippy dippy side of it, but uh, but but. That's why we're into podcasting, because, you know, I can just start spin something up like this show. And now I have, you know, a hundred of you listening out there, apparently, you know, I mean, out of nowhere that I wouldn't have had before. And with, you know, and, and anybody can do that. And and uh, I don't know what am I complaining about? It's five bucks. But, you know, is it enough for me to go to Lipson or go to some other service? from what I already have working very well for me, or maybe I'm on another service that I'm paying for, and I need to move over here just to get on Spotify. No, I don't think it's worth it for that. I think unless you see a really big uptick from that. But um, and, and, and again, wait and see. This just launched. Give it time. But still, that Spotify is putting these shows as part of their big kind of content relaunch here, I think that speaks to a lot of the power of podcasting, of course, that, that you know, there is this podcast growth that's happening right now. It's coming back around. Aren't you glad you didn't dive out when everybody asked if podcasts were still a thing uh, three years ago, right? Uh, there's a lot of possibilities. There's a lot of, a lot of things you can do. And, uh, and it's really good to see that. So what do you think? I, I want to hear from Spotify users. I got to tell you what, this news also made me um, drop in. Uh, I finally download Spotify. I think I did once and I was like, oh, whatever. This is, you know, we're just kind of poking around the free version. I didn't see the point of it. But now there's all this stuff. I want to just kind of go and see what kind of content are they going to have on this thing. They're going to have exclusive comment, content. I think I saw from Amy Poehler, for instance. Okay. Uh, you know, a, a really big content plan. And as far as that content, they are going to have ESPN, ABC, uh, NBC, as I mentioned, Comedy Central, with Rod City being pictured even in this article, uh, with Engadget. I think that's great. I think that's 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 awesome. Uh, so another place, another place on your app that you're going to find Saturday Night Live skits, I'm sure. But let me know what you think at Sorgatron on the Twitters, Sorgatron.com. Maybe if you found this video on Facebook or the YouTube, you can comment on there. Please share it. Please subscribe to it on the iTunes. It's a fun thing. Speaking of podcasting, apparently, I keep hearing this. I keep hearing this from the professionals. Uh, encourage your audience, even if they don't use uh, iTunes in particular, to listen or view you. Uh, please ask them to subscribe because it will help people find the show. Rate on iTunes. There are so many aggregators out there. I don't even know where the show shows up anymore because, or any of these because some sites just take that feed from iTunes. And if uh, you're moving up the ranks in iTunes, then, of course, you're going to move up the ranks on those other aggregators as well. So please check it out. Sign up for the newsletter at Sorgatron.com. We'll see you guys actually next week. I decided that I decided we're not going to overstress ourselves around here. We don't have any sponsors to commit to or anything yet. So uh, we're going to be taking Friday off as I'll be out in Greensburg at the uh, Sisters of Charity uh, conference. 
Uh, it's going to be talking about uh, holistic health and faith, I believe. And I'm going to be covering the media for that for our friends at Seclair. Uh, so uh, uh, keep an eye out on that. Uh, I'll, of course, be probably retweeting and doing a little bit of stuff on my accounts on Twitter uh, throughout the day here Friday. Uh, of course, I will get the uh, newsletter out to you guys. I don't know what topic. If, you, if, you're, if you're listening to this today, hit me up some tweets. If you got any topic ideas you want me to do for the blog, they can kind of roll out there a little bit more. So I'll see you guys next time. This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.